should be going for that hallway and he misses. Oh, goodness, another arm wrench there. Here we go, one, two, could be it. Just kick out there by Mario Page. Not only that, later tonight, I mean, we have your old buddy, Severino Corrente, who's gonna be taking on the former champion, Curtis Cole, his first match since losing that title to Tyler Stinson in that epic encounter they had in the main event of Milestone. Recovered. I don't know if he's had enough time to really recover that arm. Back then. And you got to hand it to Severino Corrente. A hooker crook. He was able to pull out the victory there. Hey, the no, wait a minute now. And I, you know, I let my temper get the best of me. I did, I won that match. Looks like Austin Reddick here coming from the top. Call his shot. Mario Banger in big trouble here. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, you're kidding. Show off. Anyway, I won that match. I was impressed with Severino Corrente as much as it pains me to say in that match to see the new submission styles that he was using to get to in that match. I mean, we saw that sharpshooter that he used. We saw that he had the Sicilian stretch. A lot of different moves that he was able to use in that that we haven't seen from Severino in the past. No, he, I, I can't take away from the competitor that he is. And he's a technical guy and someone that has only been in professional wrestling for a short amount of time. He took me to the limit. I won't take it away from him. I just, I let my temper get the best of me, and I did something that I, I, I'm ashamed of that I should have never done, and I know uh, referee Dewey Larson would be too happy with me when he returned, but I didn't like the way that the, it was reversed after I'd already won the match because I wouldn't let go, and you know, now we sit where we are. Again, why I am so adamant about regaining control of not just my company. We're at a my, four count right here, man. We gotta make sure that it looks like Five, and it looks like Austin versus me. Sorry, I cut you off. No, no, I'm just saying, I just gotta get control of my company, but myself. I'm trying to really calm down, really trying to ground myself again. And I'm trying to spread that throughout the company because things have been insane in the last couple Well, you gotta know, deep down, this is just my commentary here. It looks like Mario was some offense here. Ooh, he's got him on his shoulders. Brings him down. This is a, could be it here against Mario. One, two. Oh, yeah, foot on the rope. What a veteran move there by Mario Banger. You know, what I was saying there is you got a lot on your plate, man. And, you know, you got a lot of people rooting for you right now, but you got to be careful. Oh. Gotta watch all the people that you've been pissing off here like that. Yeah, that's a good one. Dude. <laughs> Colin. I piss everybody off all the time. That's all that's happened since 2010 when I started this whole thing. Someone's always pissed. Someone doesn't like what you're doing with them. Somebody doesn't like the way you run things. Somebody doesn't like the way you promote. Somebody doesn't like the way you train. Somebody doesn't like this. They don't like that. They don't like what you said to them. It's constant. It's been constant. I've tried to be as nice as I can to as many people as possible and, and give everybody a fair shake. And somebody always, without fail, has a problem. It just seems like now it's piled up on me and everybody on the roster seems to have a problem. Except for Curtis Cole, he's the only one that I don't think said anything. Ooh, a hard kick there by Austin Reddick. A failed attempt at the chicken wing there. Here he goes. Points up and uh oh! This could be the cross body here. Mario Vanger with one arm is able to just take the fall away slam there over to Austin Reddick and finally some momentum here for sugar free Mario Vanger looking to get some sort of redemption after being jumped from behind last season here by Austin Reddick.